A happy holidays to one and all. Of course, for the last couple of weeks here at Channel 9, we've been doing our holiday recipes. Well, now a day past Christmas, you've got all the extra eggnog in the house. Yes. And if there is one thing our family loves on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, that is a ton of eggnog. Okay. I have Sophia Devine and Noah Devine here, my niece and nephew. And you guys are going to walk me through this. This is a fun recipe that we've done, and it is one where you uh, you have the little ones putting out and yeah. peeling out the candy, and us to do the the cookies. So, here's how we start. We have very simply in a, a nice big mixer butter. You do I think six tablespoons, and then yes. how much eggnog do we throw in, Sophie? We put in about a quarter cup of eggnog mm -hmm. and about three quarters of a cup of granulated sugar. You throw it in a mixer, and then you do one egg. One egg. One, one tablespoon of baking soda, yes. one teaspoon of baking powder, and then two cups of flour and a little dash of nutmeg. Get it all into the mixer. Yeah. We're not going to spare you with the 30 seconds of yeah. craziness with this. <laughs> and then at that point, you let it chill for about an hour. Yeah. Yeah. And at that point, you uh, you send the little ones here to peel out as many Hershey Kisses as they can for later on. After it chills, you have it right here in a dough. Why don't you show them what we do? We well, put out a little bit of sugar on a plate, right? You yeah. turn it into like a little ball. Mm-hmm. What do you want for Christmas this year? I would like the second graphic novel ba babysitter's book. Wow. Yeah. And how about you, Noah? I want a Nerf gun. A Nerf gun. Okay. And then after you roll it into a ball, mm -hmm. you kind of roll it in some sugar. Sure. And then you put it on... Okay. The tray. This should make 32. Hopefully. You put them two inches apart, put them out there on a greased pan. It's going to probably take you two pans to do it. Yeah. And then at that point, you pop, um, it, in the oven. You pop it in the oven. I think it's 350 yes. for seven, seven to nine, nine minutes. minutes. But what's the one cautionary tale about this when you put them in the oven? Make sure it's not overcooked. That's right. You don't want to overcook you these. You want the bottoms to look kind of golden brown. Yep. And that's about all. You want to make sure, even if you kind of go on a little bit of caution with that. So, magic of TV, you pop these in, you take those out. Now, bear in mind, we don't really have the oven on. I think that's a very good idea with the three of us here to not have the oven on. And so when they come out, they will come out as just the sugar cookie. And this is where the magic happens. And I think you can have a little fun with this. You can use M&Ms, you can use certain kinds of mint candy if you want to, things that are easily chewable. And when they come out, you are going to take the Hershey Kisses that you've had the young ones unwrapping for quite a long time, and then kind of they're like five kind of twist it mm -hmm. into the cookie. And then you kind of let it cool for a little bit. And, and then, then and then you eat. And then you eat. And then you eat them. And they are delicious. They are wonderful. They're called eggnog blossoms. They are yes. a family fun recipe and a New Year's resolution. Uh, I would like to spend a little more time with my family this wow. year. Wow. That's really nice. Yeah. Even him? Yeah. Probably. Yes. I would like to get more sleep. What do we have to say to everybody? Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays.